Hey everyone, Camden here with the Ranking Ball Preview Show for February 26, 2019. Let's go. Here are NBA standings. So far in the Eastern Conference, still we have the Bucks, Raptors, and Pacers. Uh, in the West, you have the Warriors, Nuggets, and Thunder. Uh, you know, pretty close tie going on into the Western Conference. Uh, there's a lot of good games coming up tonight in the NBA, so let's find out what they are. First off, let's go over the scores from last night's games. We have the Warriors over the Hornets, Blazers over the Cavs, Pacers over the Pistons, Nets over the Spurs, Suns over the Heat, Bucks over the Bulls, Rockets over the Hawks, Grizzlies over the Lakers, Wolves over the Kings, 76ers over the Pelicans, and Clippers over the Mavericks. Only got three matches tonight, but there's some pretty good ones. Uh, first, you have the Magic at the Knicks, and then you have a pretty big Eastern Conference game tonight with Celtics at Raptors, and then a huge Western Conference game with the Thunder and the Nuggets. Sports news. Yeah, in the NBA, and James Harden ends his 30-plus point per game streak at 32. Um, in the other night game, he scored 28 points against the Hawks in a one in a 119 111 victory. So their team won, but he and only scored uh, 28 points in that game. So he wasn't able to extend his point streak. Our, you know, it seems pretty you know, hard to reach, you know, with Wilt Chamberlain reaching that with uh, 65 games in the 61 to 62 uh, season. So, you know, 32, I mean, 32 games is still a pretty good, you know, streak. You know, a lot, not, even, not a lot of people are even going to reach that in the future. So, you know, James Harden should be proud. He's been playing really well. And uh, hopefully, you know, you can go on another point streak. So he definitely is the leading scorer for that team. He is the one probably, you know, carrying the Rockets uh, to where they are now. <clears throat> also, speaking of snapping streaks, the Phoenix Suns snap a 17 loss streak in a 124-121 win against the Miami Heat. You know, upsets me. I'm a huge Heat fan, but, you know, this <laughs> the Suns, you know, you never want to be in that position where you're just constantly losing. It just makes the whole team feel just down. So I'm sure the Suns are pretty happy now with uh, with a win. In the NFL, Raiders are signing an extension to stay in Oakland for at least one more year uh, and an option in 2020. So in the 2019 season, they'll stay in Oakland for another year. Um, their Las Vegas stadium is still not finished where they plan on being. Uh, so they plan on being there in 2020, but they have that uh, 2020 option to stay in Oakland if their Las Vegas stadium is not finished. Um, other NFL news, Ravens have released Michael Crabtree after just one year. Uh, he only made 54 catches for 677 receiving yards with three touchdowns. Um, he's not really meshing with the new Ravens quarterback, and so they want to let him go. All right, so we got some really big breaking ranking ball news for a lot of you out there. You know, it's going to be pretty exciting, uh, so let's get into it. All right. Here you go. So RBG is going to be listed on CoinBene starting March 18th. Uh, a lot of you know we had our second ICO on CoinBene a couple mo uh, month ago. And starting March 4th to the 17th, we're going to have our initial exchange offering. So make sure you sign up for CoinBene if you are a Ranking Ball coin holder or if you're interested in Ranking Ball Gold RBG. Please go to CoinBene.com. Uh, if you have any other questions, you can always contact us uh, on Telegram and social media, uh, and we'll try to answer any questions that you might have. All right, now we got tonight's featured game with the Thunder at the Nuggets. It's at 10.30 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, here are injuries uh, for the Thunder, Andre Robinson. For the Nuggets, you got Brandon Goodwin, Trey Lyles, and Michael Porter Jr. So everybody's out. There's no questions, you know, injuries. So you know who's going in, who's not going in um, up front. Your previous game starters, uh, when the Thunder lost to the Trailblazers and the Nuggets beat the Clippers, uh, 
when we have go into our next game, so your possible starters are going to be exactly the same. Don't expect any changes to this lineup. Um, it's a pretty solid lineup for both teams, and they're both going to be competing for uh, pretty hard this to this uh, this night. All right. So, like I said before, I'm going to be trying to getting some more uh, information for you guys to give it to you. Um, here are some ratings for the players and for the Nuggets. These are exclusive ranking ball only stats that you'll only be able to get on this show. So uh, if you're going in tonight's Thunder Nuggets game, take a look into these uh, stats. They're going to help you a lot in choosing who do you want for your, uh, for your team. So everything lined up right now is the FP per season. It's from the highest to the lowest. Uh, for each team, so for the Thunder, you know, top is Russell Westbrook, Russell Westbrook, sorry. And for the Nuggets, you have Nikola uh, Gojokic, jo jo right. hopefully I said it right. So, here are your ratings for uh, tonight's game uh, for the Thunder and the Nuggets. And what I did is that going into the next slide, is I have my winning 16. So before, I just gave the separate teams, but I'm going to be trying to give it to you, because you are picking a solid team uh, a singular team in ranking ball, so I'm gonna give it to you that way going forward from the winning 16. Um, the way that this is all listed right now is the FP uh, per 48 minutes. So this is how many fantasy points per minute the uh, someone is going going to be making in ranking ball. Like no, sorry, in in the match. So we see here is he like 1.06. That means that for every minute. He's averaging every minute. Russell Westbrook is averaging every minute a fantasy point per minute. Um, so that's the way that stat works for you. So there's a lot of viable. Uh, this is a lot of valuable information that you should be using on Ranking Ball. And like I said, you can only get it here on the Ranking Ball preview show. Here are some other key takeaways for you to take. We got some uh, some more advanced stats um, and. The last five game stats for you. Uh, la, any any differences? You know, you see the Thunder's are, Thunder is scoring a lot more points than the Nuggets at this point in time um, in the last five games. So you have to expect, even though the Nuggets are four and one, Thunder are three and two. Um, the Thunder are scoring a lot more points than the Nuggets, so that could be an advantage for the Thunder tonight. Um, but you know, usually as we know that the Thunder is mostly reliant on the superstars of the team, where the Nuggets are able to pass the ball around um, and spread the fantasy points, spread the ball, spread the you know, distribute the wealth around the whole team compared to the Thunder. So finally, what I have for you is my lineup going into to tonight. Um, you'll notice that I didn't go eight and eight, uh, meaning eight players from away, eight players from home. I went a nine and seven. I'm pulling uh, nine home players and nine seven that way. The reason I'm doing this, like I said before, the Denver Nuggets are pretty good at passing around the ball and distributing the fantasy points. A lot of the players have even fantasy points uh, per minute. They're going around. They're they're some means they're passing the ball around. They're giving the ball to uh, you know they're scoring fantasy points in a lot of different ways. But it doesn't mean like one player like Paul George or what like Westbrook who are scoring um, these points. The whole time uh so what i did is lined up paul george westbrook together with the only superstar from the nuggets um and jeremiah grant next to here because what i know about this is that grant's gonna be starting and then these are the four players that are gonna be scoring the most points even though grant isn't uh up closer he's gonna it's gonna be matching um this line right here so it'll be it'll be matching uh probably every every two minutes of game time uh this will probably hit a fantasy uh bingo multiplier uh but i'm also adding a lot because even these two lines here are also very are considered i don't mind if these lines are hitting as well like a lot of these players are going to be uh passing the ball together and going to be uh contributing to a lot of points and fantasy points uh to your lineup tonight so this is my strategy going into tonight, and then we'll see how it goes later tomorrow. All right, everyone, that's the end of the Ranking Ball Preview Show for February 26, 2019.
Uh, I want to thank you for watching. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, and Telegram, and everywhere else on social media. And I'll check you out tomorrow. Bye.